Any person that has been lucky enough in this world to taste just a little bit of success, they understand that you can't do it alone. We can run the porcelain tomorrow. The relationship that I have with my chef is one of the most important relationships I have in my life. Father, son, don't want to disappoint him. <laughs> I'm Mark Forgione, I'm a restaurateur. Use the hiss. <laughs> if we can get this en croute production to where it's an everyday thing, I'm mm. telling you, that dish was nice. I agree. We had a New York Times review, we got a, a Michelin star for the second or third time. Or Zagat went up like four points, and then the Iron Chef thing happened like two months later. Food is supposed to be something that soothes your soul, that makes you happy, and the people that allow me to, to expand and to, to create and, and come up with these wacky ideas. So you think white with that dish? I mean, you don't want to eat red with Brussels, but well, you got the Bordelais sauce on there, right? We only have 12 of these left? Jesus. You know, I've had other opportunities that have come my way that I think I'd be stupid to say no to. Because of that, I can't be here every day. So to have people like Andy be able to hold down the fort while I'm gone. Everyone sitting at this table would be here at 9 in the morning for brunch. Is near and dear to my heart. And, you know, it's the reason that I'm able to sleep well at night. I'm trying to make a pork seafood sausage. I think he has a lot of trust in me to be here when he is not here and know that things are rolling the way they should be. We bounce off of each other. There's a bunch of leeks downstairs too. Do you want to mix in the leeks with the Brussels sprouts? I think he sees food the same way I do. Food is not supposed to be something that you have to spend hours contemplating your soul before you put it in your mouth. The standards he holds to me and to everybody is very high. It should have gone just like that before I got here. I do not want to disappoint him. We work with each other. Some have been there since day one. Others have been here a year. Each one of them is just as important as the next. If you start to think that you're cooler than the guy next to you, okay, try to do it without him, see what happens.